All right, Shalom. First and foremost, I want to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh by Shimei of Shai, double honors to the apostles and elders of the great millstone, and salutations to the Yaki and pushing his word in truth, sincerely and charity. Hey, I call it all. Uh, the Spirit have found me to 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 make this lesson. I call it, and it's uh, it's about um, you know, Jacob's trouble coming, cause that's right around the corner. You know, you have um. You have uh, these UN troops coming into Chicago. You have uh, martial law almost hey, is right around the corner. You have the RFID chip already here. You have these race wars already already starting to stir up. Hey, you have the the famine of, of bread coming. You have the famine of of hearing of hearing the the words of the Lord. Hey Amen. It looks like every year that passes by, it looks like this place is gonna, is, is gonna is done with man and every year that we say that this, this is the year and it's not hey man these things are still coming to pass you know i'm gonna start off with uh jeremiah 30 and 7 at last for that day is great so that none is like it hey this this day is gonna be a day never seen before man because there's gonna be a lot of things happening man you know you're gonna have uh cannibalism com coming out here you're gonna have uh, people against people. It's gonna be chaos out here, man. Just like how it says in the scriptures, man. When when Yahweh Shah returns, he says, um, it says, uh, I come to send fire on the earth, but one for it to already be kindled. Because before, when the Lord, before the Lord comes back, this place is already gonna be in chaos. You know, it's gonna be all over the place, man. It's gonna be anarchy out here. It's gonna be insane. Um, and it's even a time when Jacob's trouble. But he shall be saved out of it. Hey, it's gonna be the time of Jacob's trouble, man. Two per, two th um, two parts, uh, two thirds of our people are gonna be cut off and die, man. Which is these so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, you know, the ones that chose not to come back to repent and follow the ways of the Lord. Hey, you you people are gonna die, but hey, he shall be saved out of it. Talking about the elect and the one third, the 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 people that the Lord has mercy upon. This um, um Isaiah fifty nine and starting at uh nineteen, so shall they like so shall they fear the day of the Lord from the west and his glory from the rising of the sun, when the when the enemy shall like when the enemy shall come in like a flood, the spirit of the Lord shall lift up a standard against him and. The enemy is gonna come in like a flood, man. You're gonna have martial law, um, martial law here, and as a when martial law kicks off, man, man, that's how we're gonna be even closer and closer to coming to coming back uh, into the kingdom of heaven, man. And it's gonna be our time. It's gonna be our time, man, to rule. Um, fifteen. Okay, all right. Let's just um. Okay, I'm gonna start out. All right, this is Second Ezra is fifteen and fifteen, for the for the sword, and their destruction draweth nigh, and one people shall stand up to fight against another, and the swords in their hands. Hey, these are gonna be these race wars, man. You know, you're gonna have one nation against another, for there shall be sedition among men and invading one another. They shall not regard their kings nor princes, and the uh, and the course of their action shall stand in their power. Hey, you're gonna have um, you're gonna have sedition among men, man. You're gonna have people invading one another in their own homes, not caring about them, stealing their goods. Hey, these this this um this day is coming and is gonna is gonna is right around the corner. These men are gonna be screaming like women giving birth, man. You know, but us. Us knowing what's coming, and we hold we hold on to the truth and believe 
and have faith in the Lord, hey man, there's gonna be nothing done unto us, man. And and if we die, if we die in this truth, so be it, man. Like I was saying, in uh, I think it's uh Psalms 116 and 15, precious in the sight, precious in the sight of the Lord is the death of his saints. And we we better we better pray and hope that we die in this truth, man. You know, and not going back to the world, because as we know, and um, I would say in the scriptures that uh, that uh, I call it um, it, it is better if you have known if not it's like it is better if you have not known the way of righteousness, a eh? because a regular two third is gonna be beaten with few stripes, but the the servant that knew he shall be beaten with many stripes, because he knew better, man. Hey, it's gonna be it's gonna be hell out here. Um, a man shall desire to go into a city and shall not be able. Hey, you're gonna have these martial law man with these checkpoints, not letting you go anywhere but that one specific spot they put you in. For because of their pride, the city shall be troubled. The house, the houses shall be destroyed, and men shall be afraid. Hey, these these men out here, these these people, these men out here in um. In America, man, they're not even men anymore, man. They're women. You know, they 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 act like women. They buck up like women. They act like women. They love these women, and they they're around these women, so they become a woman. They are raised by a woman, so hey, they're gonna act like a woman, man. Um. Verse nineteen: A man shall have no pity upon his neighbor, but shall destroy their house. With the sword and spoil their goods because of the lack of bread and for a great tribulation. Hey, hey, that's the famine, man. That's the famine soon to come. Hey, it was in Venezuela and it's slowly creeping its way up, up in America. Alright. This is, uh. Uh, where is. Jeremiah 16 and 4 They shall die of grievous deaths They shall not be lamented Neither shall they be buried But they shall be as dug like it. But they shall be as dung Upon the face of the earth And they shall be consumed by the sword And by the famine And their carcasses shall be meat For the fowls of, of heaven And for the beast of the earth Hey, so there's going to be a lot of A lot of um, Corpses out here in the streets when when uh, when Jacob's trouble comes, there's gonna be so many bodies that they're not even gonna be buried, man. They're just gonna be laying right there in the street. And these uh like these crows, these dogs, these raccoons, like you know all the all the all these um all these creatures, these dead bodies are gonna be uh, are gonna be food for them, man. They're gonna have a feast. They're definitely gonna eat good, you know. Um. um Okay, I'm gonna keep on reading. Verse five. Verse five. For thus saith the Lord, enter not into the, into the house of mourning, neither go lamb it for for uh, woman. Them, for I have taken away my peace from this people, saith the Lord, even loving kindness and mercies, both the great, it's like you're both the great and shit, it's like you um, both the great and the small shall die. In this land, they shall not be buried, neither shall men lamb it for them, nor cut themselves, nor make themselves bald for them. Hey, you know, hey, these people, these people are gonna be buried, man. There's gonna be too, too many uh, bodies to bury, man. It's just one thing that's not gonna happen, man. And that day is gonna be a usual, it's gonna be a usual thing to see just a a, a dead body, you know. You're gonna come around the corner and see a dead body and not really care about it because you've seen plenty of them before. Um, um no idea. Is uh Connor. This is um 
This is uh, Isaiah, no, it's like a Proverbs 1 and 20. Wisdom cried without, she uttered her voice in the streets. She crieth in the chief place of the concourse, in the opening of the gates, and in the city, she uttereth her words, uh, saying, and that's what we do on the highways and byways, man, where there's the most people. You know, like how it says in Isaiah 58 and 1, cry aloud, spare not, lift up that voice like a trumpet, and show, show the house of Jacob their transgressions. <laughs> Um, how long will ye simple ones, uh, you can't, how long will ye simple ones, uh, will ye lust simplicity, and the scorners delight in their scorning, and fools hate knowledge? Turn you at my reproof, behold, I will pour out my spirit on you, I will make, I will make known my words unto you, because I have called, and ye refuse, I have stretched out my hand, and no man regarded, but ye have set at naught, and, and, so I can set and not all my counsels and would none of my reproof. I will also laugh at your calamity. I will mock when your fear cometh. Hey, cause the Lord, the Lord is gonna mock it and mock you, man. Cause hey, now you, now you wanna, now you believe in the truth. Now you believe that the Lord, um, is a so-called Negro. Now you believe uh, that the Lord's name is Yahweh and the Son's name is Yahweh Shai. Hey, man, like I say in the scriptures, man, the Lord is in a the Lord is uh is gonna mock you, you know. As there's a scripture that says that the Lord is gonna say uh um call upon your God, let them save you, you know, because you choose to follow, you chose to follow these false idols and these false um these false doctrines. Hey, so now so now let the now let now let the um, the idol you the the idol you chose to worship let him save you. Hey, but he's not gonna save you because that idol's not real. That 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 statue and all that stuff is in your house uh, that you believe in. Hey, that was made by men, man, and that's just that's just nothing. Um, so this is uh, Psalms five and five and eighteen. What want to you the desire the lay of, What want to you the desire the day of the Lord? To what end is it for you? The day of the Lord is darkness and not light. Hey, and that's that's that was coming, man, because the Lord is coming to send fire on this place, man. The Lord's gonna come back with a sword. Um and for you people also, woe unto you the desire the day of the Lord. To what end is it for you? So hey, you don't even know what's coming, man. You don't know that all the destruction is coming. The Lord's gonna come back with vengeance. Hey, and the Lord didn't kill you people that chose not to follow him. This is a uh, uh, reading on, on verse 19. As if a man did flee from a lion and, and a bear met him. Hey, so, all right. So a man uh, ran, he ran away from a lion and he got away and he, he met a bear. Reading on, or went into the house and leaned his hand on the wall and a serpent bit him. Hey, and it shall not the day of the Lord be darkness and not light, even very dark and no bright um brightness in it. Hey, so all right, so this man, um, you got a picture in your in your mind when you read the scriptures. So a man, um, uh, uh, was uh, running away from a lion. He escaped. He and then a, a bear met him, and he ran away and escaped. And I call it, he, he went into the house, leaned his hand, and a serpent bit him. Hey, wherever you are, man, there's going to be trouble right there on, on the spot. You know, that's why in that day, uh, we're going to be circumspect. And one thing that you people are going to be missing out on, because you chose not to do, not to seek the Lord, while he, uh, you know, like it says in the scripture, seek the Lord while he may be found. You people are going are gonna to start looking at him the last second, man. Hey, but it's gonna be too late. Like I'll say right here, I uh saw it's like it. Amos eight and eleven. Behold, the days come, saith the Lord God, I will send a famine in the land, not a famine of bread nor a thirst of water, but of hearing the words of the Lord, and they shall wa wander from sea to sea, and from the north even to the east, they shall run and fro to seek the word the word of the Lord. And shall not find it, hey, because this famine, this famine, the word is coming, man. They're gonna shut down the internet. They're gonna come after us. 
and they're they're gonna want to they're gonna want the true prophets, man, because they don't want to they don't want us teaching the, the people right now, man. And all we're doing is just reading uh reading this book and waking up our people. But as when our people will start waking up, Esau's kingdom is gonna come down. Hey, but you people, hey, you still have um uh, the door is still open, man, for you to come in. But hey, you're not taking heed. So a hey, destruction onto you. Hey, but that's all I wanted to get into. You know, Lord willing, this video was edifying. But with that, I want to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh by Shimei Oshai. Your honors to the Apostle the Elder Green Millstone. And salutations to the Akim pushing his word and truth, necessarily with charity. And with that, Shalom.